usually start this stage, from my understanding. Yeah, this is uh, this is John's propaganda. The uh, the small battlefield for starter. Yeah. Three, Don't buy into it, guys. Two, <laughs> it's one, it's all a lie. Uh, who picked Megalovania? John. God damn it, John! Now. You come bitch. Come on now, John. He's me. Yeah. All right. All right, so just kind of start things off with a few scrambles here and there. Uh, now with gyro in hand, not not doing too much with it, just tossing it away. Yeah. Oh, nice for the wave one. Just trying to get the tech chase right there. Ooh, actually using the sun salutation to catch Dill coming down with the uh, the neutral air. Dill thought John was going to try and press it with advantage with uh, maybe like some hitboxes, but. Can't stay on the ledge that long. You're getting deep breathing down tilted. Yeah, and what is it? Rob doesn't have a large ledge thing, so there's the ability to catch it and the up smash missing. This is just not working out for Dill right now. Until this moment. Ooh. Okay, gets the gyro extension button. Number still has his jump, and we see him doing that so often, uh, like just drifting around the ledge to avoid any sort of down air shenanigans. That means John Number is gonna be living uh, a bit longer with his first stock while trying to rack up some more extra credit. Yeah. All right. You see there, it's not working out right there. And yeah, this is just not looking good for Dill. This is not the ability to close this out on numbers. Well, we saw like last set with Shaka, like the ability to take the game, able to close it out right there, but Shaka was able to close out the stocks pretty early on the games he took. And it's just not looking the same for Dill right now. He's taking too much damage at 81% right now. And numbers still basically fresh. Yeah, no, absolutely. I mean, the way that John plays, John plays such a good defensive game that it's like, if you're not able to explode his stock, then he's going to be living quite a while. Yeah. And you're going to get frustrated trying to get that kill. And he's essentially a stock ahead. 26 damage. That's virtually a, a breath. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yeah, just a quick uh, platform conversion there with the down throw. And the damage just keeps coming for Dill. Just can't really seem to get anything started. It feels like John has been reading pretty much all of her approaches thus far, and most of Dill's damage, I feel like, has just come from, like, this chip damage. Yeah. And already at 120. I like the idea there by John going for kind of a cheeky Z-drop gyro into back air, not finding it. Dill finally catching John going a little oh. bit too far out with the deep breathing and getting things to even stocks, but 120, Dill's got to pull out uh, some kind of miracle. Yeah, hopefully one of those Rob combos, but dash <laughs> attack, not going to take right no. there, giving us the false finish. John waiting patiently at the ledge. Yeah, Dill. Dill? Okay. What was that? Probably an F tilt, but Dill did a great job of um, just trying to stall out that um, deep breathing, mm -hmm. but unfortunately didn't work out right there. That's essentially why she went high for so long, just trying to stall it out. Yep, and then yeah. what was... Yeah, that's okay, it was f tilt. Yeah. <clears throat> Oof. Stop the battle. Even John's like, eh, yeah. I don't know. John has two ma had two masks on, just took one, took the bottom one off. Three, yeah, that's he was his, double masked up. His, his power inhibitor, he took it off. Now he's getting, he's, getting he's, even stronger. Yeah, no, he's trying to win this game to ASAP. Yeah. Yeah, almost had the tech chase right there, but good job being on the open platform for Dill. But she takes less damage. All right, and John just making his home underneath this small battlefield platform, forcing Dill to be the one to approach. And that's really just not what you want to do against John numbers. Yeah, no. You, you do want to approach him because he like he's on the ledge, but yeah. it's like you you want it on your turn. Uh, yeah. Okay, great air dodge there by Dill, avoiding the soccer ball. Oh. Ooh, okay, great reaction by Dill. That's a from behind too. Yeah. Yeah. Loki Zamba rune back in for all Robins. <laughs> <Right? laughs> Okay, F tilting there. That soccer ball almost hit, just barely disappeared at the yeah. end there. 
Ooh, that was all right spicy. There. A number is, has Sun Salutation. No deep breathing, though. Uh, Almost, yeah. John's getting, John's getting pretty cheeky with these these gyros, but oh my god, I think the deep breathing actually saved John's it life. It definitely saved his life. There was no way John was living without it. All right, there. Not gonna happen. Ooh, and yeah. Miss times it. That's gonna be John taking the stock one. Yeah, she's been mistiming it. Unfortunately, all day for like the majority of them, and that's the first time she's like actually died. And she's been doing that same like mix up, like the back dash, um, arm rotor. Mm -hmm. It is worked out for the most part, but John has that scouted. It's like the, what happens when you like place with someone for so long. Oh, yeah, they know like all your little habits that you like, like to fall back into. Yeah, that was such a great dash attack right there, catching Dill coming in. Now we're going to be putting John off stage again. Another laser, but John still has his jump, I think. Oh, oh no, just barely. Yeah, still going to be getting that sock relatively free in terms of having to edge guard it, but you know, 62%. And, I mean, John lived to, like, what, 180 that stock? So, I mean, she's she's really had to work for these stocks. Oh, no. She, yes, no, she's definitely working hard. Ooh, okay, but back air. Ooh, okay. Still not able to find these down airs, unfortunately. Yeah. And she backed off all the way just because she's like, okay, I can't pressure him like without making it a risk. So I'm just going to reset the neutral and we're just going to play on the even terms again. Yeah, just try and, you know, get these little openings with gyro and laser and then try and, you know, live to fight another day. Yeah. Okay. Is John's jump, but again, doing the down air way too early that yeah. time. And John also able to get her with the get up attack. That's like something he rarely does. And just knowing it's gonna work there. Especially on like an aerial that was just done. Oh, Tomahawk. Alright, Jaro now set up on the platform. Let's see, no, again, this drift from John. She's doing wonders, and Dill just hasn't found a way to get around it. Okay. Was able to down tilt at that time, so John had to reset, but for the most part, she can't get like a bigger punish, like mm -hmm. a dare. Oh, but this game is basically even up, and in percent wise, Dill has the lead. Oh, as but, I say that. Yeah, no, John had the deep breathing, so he was quite a bit closer to getting, getting a raw kill like that. Ooh, you gotta be careful down there, Dill. Ooh, especially that's a lot of gas you're using. Yeah, yeah. It's with right. these, with these times, yeah, it's yeah, like right? six dollars. Yeah, come on now. Ten dollars somewhere else. All right, so Dill still sitting fresh on this last stock. So we'll see if she can get this kill pretty early. But as I say that, good conversion there by John. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, Dill is just struggling to get this kill right now. Finally, once again, pretty much 180 after the hit there. A decent amount of extra credit for John numbers. Yeah, but see how quick she's like essentially virtually tied it. Mm-hmm. Ricky little angle there with the soccer ball skidding over those platforms yeah. and using the sun salutation there to catch pretty much all angles covering both the platform and Dill on the ground. Yeah, and I'm liking this from Dill. She's not forcing the issue. Mm -hmm. She's trying to, she's having it come to her on her terms and she's like, okay, my setups will come and the game state will come to me. Ooh, real long lasting hit of the bear right there, still hitting John. All right. Breathing is online again. Still, like you were saying before, just try and stall it out. Yeah. Ooh, John tried to head her there, but bumped his head on the, oh, the gyro. Oh, pivot. Down throw. Okay, amazing mash. That's our Nintendo World Champion um, yeah. right there. Yeah, no, John, uh, he, like, put out a video of how he mashes out of out of down throw and, like, immediately gets the air dodge after it. So he's got that tech on lockdown. Yo. Oh! No way! The betrayals. I've been waiting for this. Oh, man.
<laughs> Haven't seen betrayal like that since the buzz in the Pikmin. <laughs> Shot the up right know there. You. The laser into yo. We playing basketball. <laughs> Couldn't even see it on the camera. That's yeah. just how how gruesome it was. That's such a dope snipe though. It was. All right. So we're in game three. Game three. We got Snake Eater on music. And I think we're bringing it back. Yeah, bringing it right back to small One, battlefield. Two, it'll never change it. No. With John numbers, never. No. Never. Good job of Dill, like, voiding that up tilt. That, the arm was basically intangible. And a lot of people try to contest it and, like, land on top of it. And you just can't do anything with it right there. Dill right now playing so well on the ledge. And if you compare this to like game one, there's like so much more confidence in Dill's play now than, than there was before. Yeah, no, it felt like game one, John really had the read on all of Dill's approaches, whereas now it just feels completely reversed. Wow, the Sun Citation actually low profiling the laser. Dara is set up at the ledge again. Ooh, gets the drag down up there, but not able to find anything out of it. All right. Yeah, Dill just trying to keep her space away from John. Not, like you were saying before, just not really forcing the issue, but right there, a deep breathing combo, putting things right back to even. Now Dill at, uh, at the ledge again. Oh, Ooh. Playing with my emotions. I think she's running out of gas. She's just conserving it. Yeah. And I actually do love the way that John approached that situation because he waited so long for Dill to stall beneath the ledge to uh, get rid of that gas before going down and trying to start any like edge guards. Yeah. But there, the uh, advantage breaker sun salutation. Still oh. not able to find any of these uh, edge guard down airs. Still opting for the uh, the ledge trapping. Yeah. Oh. And, uh, the arm motor is not going to matter anything, but she's trying to go to the other side of the stage, able to grab it. Yeah, just making this platform home. And what a reaction by yeah. John to go for that uh, sun salutation after the laser. But up throw on the platform, absolutely going to be digging it. Boomstone power driver, baby. Uh, now come out and this game now a lot closer john not able to get a lot of extra credit so only 35 that's basically a quick combo from dill right here and but the big part for dill has been closing the stocks as we've seen she's been having trouble of getting an early stock and if she can get one out on john like right there like that yeah oh know. john not happy about yeah. that Sometimes life's just good for you, yes, yeah. Uh, now, oh. oh, man. <laughs> Not the instant replay again. I didn't even know we had this technology. But yeah. And the zoom in, too. All right. All right, so, John, definitely a bit of a mountain to climb right now. Gonna have to explode some stocks like we saw earlier in the set, you know, closer to game one, John. Yeah, game one, John had so much more confidence, but now there's like so much doubt. And you see in these air dodge, it's like panic air dodge, now just doing defensive options so early. And it's just now letting him so much damage onto himself. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's playing from a distance. Again, using that distance to get the deep breathing yeah. is absolutely what John needs right now. But running into gyros and not even able to use any projectiles because of the gyro. Yeah, and that's the advantage Rob gets to do. Like, just able to create that wall and to say, yeah, you actually have to approach me with the deep breathing. And this is 
my we're playing on my terms. And this is what Dill wanted to do. You saw at the end of the last game that it start they started getting their combo practice and they're just playing the entire lead like this. Yep, just really keeping John out right now and just keep harassing with that gyro and yeah, no. John's projectiles just can't do anything about it. Yeah, John just keeps trying to shoot it off, but the gyro spawns back too fast that Dill's just able to put on another one before another full sal salutation can come out. John's got to be careful about playing around under these platforms because I'm pretty sure we're, especially with Rage, we're absolutely in an up throw kill percent. Yeah, no, definitely. Right? Yep, taking the high road. Don't want to deal with deep breathing at all. Yeah, so don't want to take the low road. <laughs> Start making the main call. Dill's patience right now. Oh, oh it's over. Uh, yeah, you're dead. It's over. John Shay. Ooh, the ooh, the double toss. You usually need a recapture for that. All right. That is going to be Dill moving on into grand finals winner's side while John has to fight his way a little bit more through losers. Yeah, hopefully John is able to like, keep it together. See. Bam. The plug goes that way. The controller towards the TV. Yeah. Definitely upset on the yeah. play. They had... John was so strong game one, mm -hmm. and then he just kind of couldn't close it out game two, and then game three you saw more rattled and Dill playing with more confidence, and it just all yeah. like culminated and then, together. Yeah, then that SD happened, stock two, yeah. John died at like 20-ish. Like 26.